Welcome back. In this video, we're going to measure the compression on this Evinrude 6 horsepower. If the motor has good compression, then you know uh, it's probably going to last you a while with just minimal maintenance. Make sure to check out the video description for typical compression values for these low horsepower Johnson and Evinrude outboards. First thing, remove the boots from the spark plug. You might want to take some tape and mark the top one from the bottom one, or if you have more than two cylinders, just make sure you mark which boot goes back to what cylinder. Once you have the boots removed, go ahead and remove both or all of your spark plugs. Once you have the spark plugs removed, we're gonna use this tool. Um, you can buy it off Amazon. They're pretty cheap and they're really handy. Um, a compression tester. So usually they come in two parts like this. Um, and the reason being is you can easily thread in one side once you have it in there good and snug you can connect the other end and measure your reading the next step is to give the motor good three or four or five maybe hard normal starting pulls and measure the compression To right at 60 psi and do the same thing on the bottom cylinder the bottom cylinder is right at where the top cylinder is right around 60 aside from a good compression value you want to make sure that the cylinders are even with respect to each other and by even I mean within 5 to 10 PSI of each other. Some people say that 60 pounds PSI uh, cylinder compression is too low and the engine isn't worth anything whenever you get compression values down in that range. But I just wanted to show you that this, this motor does crank easily. The cylinder is cold. I haven't cranked it since last night. And uh, so this is a cold start and it it cranks fairly easy with 60 PSI cylinder compression. I think on these lower horsepower motors, the compression values can get down a little bit lower than you typically would see. Um, just one major thing that you want to make sure is that the compression is even. Thanks for watching.